All right, bros, we have the final round, which is the finals of the Resident Evil Reverse tournament hosted by Ico Pro Sam. And once again, shout out to Sam for hosting this great event. Everything ran smoothly. Um, this is my POV, the winning POV, because as most of you already know, to those of you who were probably in the tournament and participating, watching, etc., whatever it is, I ended up winning the whole thing. I won it very, very close. Um, in the foreseeable future, like if Sam does host another tournament or if anyone else decides to host a tournament, I won't make the same mistake of allowing it to get this close. Like, I'm going to go ahead and get a lead off the get-go and just play strategically. Now that I know the tenacities of all these players that I've gone up against, it's been a long time since i played a lot of these players. Um, even the few reps in public matches is not necessarily the same play style they're going to bring into tournament matches. But now that I've seen a couple of adaptations and how players perceive the game, etc., I'm going to make sure I don't make the same mistake again. That way, you know, I can win relatively convincingly. And like I said, you could call me super cocky for saying all this, but I have the wins to back it up. The 100% win rate, etc. You guys already know I'm the greatest of all time, so I'm not even going to keep yapping about it. Um, whether you like it or not, I'm the best, and I'm always going to be the best. Because at the end of the day, I have the most prize money. Most wins, and 100% win rate in tournaments. Most chips as well, so I'm just him. But, like I said... This was just down to the wire. At the end, it was just, like, so, so fucking close. Like, it was crazy how close it was, really. Um, but that just goes to show you the beauty of this game. It's not over until it's over. Um, I made a really great judgment call. Uh, I will say, me not double rolling in that instance where Sam peaked on the left-hand side uh, was literally one of the best choices I've ever made. In my career on reverse because i was like i'm gonna keep this extra dodge just in case a creature or someone's camping a corner etc sam peeked the left hand side to see if i was there or if there was an enemy coming from this side right here um on this side of the map on village and like i said i didn't double roll so if he would have seen me there he would have definitely used a spark shot on me because he would have gapped the lead even more and basically just ggs and game over for me but fortunate enough he ended up using that spark shot on James Grayson and then MOD Kid goes ahead and steals a kill from him. And then I pull up out of nowhere while he's spamming uh, John with the revolver on his tyrant, which luckily enough, John's tyrant wasn't super low. Otherwise, that would have wrote complete GG's as well. So just a lot of little tiny things that played out in my favor. And I'm not going to lie, I got relatively lucky right there. Um, but at the end of the day, it is what it is. I still won. So, yeah. I'm the best. Sometimes the game just helps you, you know, and this was one of those moments. Um, but nonetheless, GG saw the competition. It's always fun going up against uh, players of high caliber and who can keep their cool. And obviously, you know, when they lose, they lose. When they win, they win. It's just how shit goes, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, like I said, at the end right there, you'll see where I just pull up out of nowhere and then just pistol whip Sam and get the win. But, yeah, boys, you know, like I said, overall, great fucking event. If you do decide to make another uh, tournament, Sam, by all means, you know, hopefully I'm still invited and shit. Um, yeah, but if you don't host another one, that's completely fine as well. Like, get, like I said, host or don't host uh, to anyone out there. I'm going to participate in any kind of reverse tournament there is. And it's not about the money. Because I want to say that very clear. I wrote a whole description in my round one video. It was never about the money. It's about the legacy. It's about uh, me keeping my 100% win rate uh, written in the Reverse history books. Even though literally little to no people give a fuck about the game. But this game has done a lot for me. I've done a lot for this game. So, you know, I'm going to keep my streak going for as long as I can. And one of those things is obviously having my 100% win rate, being the winningest player of all time, being the best player of all time, the uh, most money earned, and the most chips earned, which is two tournament chips right now at the moment that I'm writing, uh, recording this video and shit. So like I said, host one or don't host one, you know, it is what it is. But if there's ever anyone out there who just throws a tournament together of Reverse, which like I said, I feel like it's very unlikely, uh, especially now because the game is at an all-time low and has been for a very long time, you know, I'm going to participate no matter how long I take a break from the game. And right here is that winning moment right there. One by ten points, boys. What can I say? You know what I'm saying?
Um, adrenaline was definitely high right there at that last kill. Obviously, I didn't choke, and I made a great judgment call, and I won. So, GG saw the competition once again, boys. And like I said, I'm probably going to make some more videos. I don't know for sure, but later.